D and thank you back to Warcraft. Much less than three. <laughs> Indeed. Hey, Runaway, what's up? Resicon, for sure. Indeed, I'm going friend. to play the Warcraft, next game. Logan and Grubby, less than three. I'm going to play the next game as seriously as possible. May Back to Warcraft be my witness. <laughs> and together with this uh, Casas Double Friss juice, which you can order yourself at grubbymerchandise.com now. Together with this. Oh, nice. Okay. Another good game in iOS. So let's see if he doesn't footman scout again. We may be able to make use of that. Because there was a few patterns to his play last game. That uh, really they were greedy, you know. Skipping barracks, attacking first, no footman scout. The, uh, the best part about footman scout is that the human can scale the amount of militia creeping he does to really big significant camps. Uh, it's annoying for the orc that, that, that the human knows wherever you go. You know that if you reveal yourself going to the top of the map, he can and will militia creep the bottom. I think I should have got circlets first, but oh well. And because he's not militia creeping, I can do this. You see, with circlets it would have been more comfortable, but it would also be slower, and it would actually be too late, lol. He's doing the same thing, so I actually, I countered him. That's, that's why I want to do something that counters directly what he was doing last game. Because he's being exposed for the dirty attacker he is. That doesn't make anything. You dirty tecker, you. It's worth not dropping to 1 HP again. Okay. 
He's doing the top right fountain, I think. Nope. He didn't do anything. Same, same. Same, same as before. You keep thinking, is it the real one? Because he's moving kind of like an idiot, but... <laughs> it is the real one. Like, what is he achieving? It's the same strat again, okay. Getting seriously concerned. I don't see him getting anything. So what is he getting? Something? I think he is. Before you know it, there's like a million towers on my base. Oh yes, that's what I was hoping for. Mass priest. The good thing is, I already crept most things of worth. What he's doing now is the red spot, I mean the expansion spot, and I'm kind of okay with that actually. It's definitely a fool's errand to go harass on his side of the map, the natural, when you're actually getting really good tech units out. I just got crit again. Crit first. Now, I don't want him to creep too much. And another cool thing is if you attack him here and force him to TP, then you have the le bottom left to creep. Now, of course, he wants to finish his camp. I get that. Oh, 
Oh, that was just the perfect fight for us, wasn't it? He doesn't even... Oh my god, he's always liking to creep the things right next to me. Nice. Yeah, magic attack can counter uh, banish to a degree. That's nice. So this is actually why I think it's so cheesy what he did in the first game on Echo Isles. Like, no barracks, no footman, no nuance, no footman scout, no reaction. Just I decide I go for one Archmage level 1.9 and I harass. I'm not really looking to do anything except waste both of each other's time. But if you go far here, I lose. If you do like uh, immediate red spot with heal ward, you get too much value. So it is a good strat. And actually TH000 does it as well. So he, of course, being TH, he does it a little better. But uh, it's like it is a counter strategy. It's not a ladder strategy. 
for example, if I go for an uh, Altar Burrow 17 foot tech against Orc, looking to do Farseer, Fire Lord, Tower Rush, if he is next to me or a close boss, he scouts me right away, he sends Blade Master right away, that's a losing proposition for me. Because he can cancel Burrows, get too much value. Uh, there's other examples, like if you ever go like no barracks tech against Elf, if they want to, you'll lose. But if you use it to counter a known enemy style, then you can get good value or good strategy. Yeah, Sentry War too. I should not be able to win this. This is typical, um, I play an OP race complex. Wanting to stay in the game despite it being over. This is what I experience when I play against Night Elf, because they know they can win with 20 food less. They never leave. Same with Orc. There's always a chance to win with Pillage. So... No leave arena. 